One night, uh, probably like six, seven years ago, we uh, uh, in my house. Uh, this is a true story. A woman ran up to my door. She was basically, you know, kind of in her, you know, undergarments, uh-huh. pounding on my door at 3 a.m. and she was having a fight with her man at the time, and we Dang. had to call 911. Then that was kind of a crazy thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, well, yeah. There was that one time where you, Jenna, and I, we were driving, and a guy had a heart attack in the middle of the road. Oh my yeah. gosh! Remember that? Yeah. Then we saw a dude save somebody's life right in front of us. Yeah. yeah. That was crazy. So there was a woman in Ohio. She just had to call 911. Uh, and tell them that she had a boa constrictor stuck on her face. What? <laughs> yeah. How does? How does and it sounds happen? like the dispatcher didn't believe her at first. I listened to the audio. She um, couldn't hear. It. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, apparently one of her pet snakes had wrapped itself around her head and bitten her nose. Oh my goodness. Well, you keep a predator in the house. Yeah, it's your own fault. Stupid yeah. is what got you. I there. don't understand why people would ever have a snake in their house. Well, unfortunately, they had to kill the snake to make it let go. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. What was she doing with the snake that close to her head? Some people, they feel, oh, but let me tell you something about Bruce the snake. Bruce the snake would never hurt me. I don't care if he's a wild snake. Bruce loves me. And then, of course, Bruce the snake wraps himself around her head. I've known a few snake owners. They always say that snakes like cuddling. They're, oh, oh they're my so God. sweet. They yeah. like to cuddle. So, Why would you ever cuddle, cuddle you so snake? much? They like to make you purple. So my <laughs> cousin has a snake, and she likes to take naps, like where it's like wrapped in her sweatshirt and stuff. Right. Oh. And so I read this article to her one time where the people think that the snake's actually trying to just cuddle, but actually it's sizing you up to try to oh eat my, you oh one day. Oh my God, God. Jenna. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> Slumber Jenna. with that snake a little bit more, because one day you might be in its tummy. Right. Hey, let's uh, let's get to the phone call. This is hey. uh, I have the audio right here. Hello. I have a boa constrictor stuck to my my face. And you have a what? Boa constrictor. Outside with it. You're outside with a boa constrictor stuck to your face. Yes. Okay. I just rubbed it. Yeah. 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 Jeez. Oh. See, he was it's trying to swallow okay. it. And let, and let me go back to uh, one of our favorite f- f- phrases on the show Stupid's what got you there. Mm-hmm. She brought it from outside inside the house yesterday. Yeah, I rescued it. I just brought <laughs> it inside the house, found it at the creek. Fitz, it's the nicest four letter word you'll say today. This is the Fitz Show.